you know, it was only a couple days after Eric was murdered that we knew it was murder. And yet, for some reason, um, you know, these people were allowed to get away with murder. And that should not happen in the United States of America. And so we're hoping if we take it to um, a little higher level, to the state of Michigan, that they will realize and they'll see all the support that's here and, um, and all the support that, you know, continues to pour in from other people that, you know, the case is bigger than just our family. It has to do with protecting the public. You know, if you have someone that it is known to be, have taken a life, um, then that person should not be roaming the streets. They should have to answer for their crimes. So to me, it's very simple. I don't know why it's taken this long. It's been more than 34 years. They had their suspect in 1983 identified um, you know, the main suspect and the other um, conspirators and for whatever reason they dropped the case. I would like to know why. I think, um, you know, maybe Kalamazoo County needs some help to figure that out if they can't do it themselves. So I'm really hoping that Attorney General Bill Schuette will um, help us with this and, you know, if anyone who's um, able to contact him and ask him you know, please, this is our, our real chance to get this case going the direction that it should be going.